I'm Chris Edwards and welcome to this week's Tennis Warehouse vlog. We're back down on the T-Dub indoor court this week and we're going to give you a playtester picks vlog this week. So I'm going to jump in with my picks for the week. First up, I've got this new shoe from Nike. This is their Zoom Court Next. I'm really enjoying this shoe. Super comfortable, very plush feel. It's got a, a really solid base to it. So it's very stable at the base, but the uppers are nice and soft and padded. So it feels really comfortable around the foot. And I'm really enjoying that juxtaposition of the soft, comfortable uppers with that really solid, stable base to help me push off and move around the court. Next up, I've grabbed a racket that I really enjoyed when we play tested it. And it's the Dunlop, the CX200 Oversize. And when we were playtesting it, I had said I would really like this racket if I had just a little bit more weight to it and maybe a leather grip. So I've done exactly that. I've got a black leather grip on it, added a little bit of tungsten T-dub tape at the tip to counterbalance it out. And I'm really enjoying the playability of this one. It's super flexible. So we've got a ton of feel for the ball. It's got that 105 square inch head size, so it can get some nice, easy, free power when I'm just blocking the ball back, when I'm playing dubs, I'm looking for you know, a nice pickup shot. It's a bit more stable and solid. Um, for that type of tennis, but in stock form, it's really fast and easy to get around. So I think it's a great racket for the improving beginner through intermediate. And then if you're a stronger level player looking for um, that oversized kind of head shape with lots of feel, great way to customize it right there and get it dialed in for your game. And then my last pick for my picks this week is the Torna Grip. And this is the Torna Tough. I was a big fan of original, but it does wear out a little quickly for my taste. And I'd actually moved on to Yonex Dry Grab um, and was really enjoying that. But the Torna Grips got me back with this Torna Tough. Lasts way longer than the original. It's in an XL, so it fits on all handle lengths. And I'm really enjoying that. Still got that great dry Torna Grip feel, but lasting uh, really well. I'm joining it on my uh, Speed Pro right here. Okay, let's check in with some of the other play testers. This week I brought two items with me and I'm actually actually wearing my first playtester pick. It is a new brand of hat that we're carrying called Vimhue. They have two styles and they're both designed to uh, help you with your ponytail management. I'm wearing the ex-boyfriend style, or was, I just took it off my head there. But uh, this one has adjustable straps here in the back in the shape of an X. The back strap is also adjustable. And uh, you can wear with this one, you can wear your ponytail high, or low and adjust to fit depending on how much hair you have or if you like wear a ponytail with a just a holder or you prefer a scrunchie like I'm wearing today. Although I really like this hat because it's also super lightweight, it's breathable with all these perforations and uh, it's one of my favorite go-tos when I'm playing outdoors and it launders really well. My second one is the latest E-Zone 100 from Yonex. I really, really like this one. This is my favorite E-Zone 100 since the DR model. And it has that unique blend of easy power and depth, but I'm finding great control and really great ball feel from this one. So I really feel confident whether I'm uh, playing from the baseline or venturing, being brave and venturing to the net. So uh, this one has been in my rotation. And as I'm looking around to see if I wanna switch up my racket of choice, this is uh, definitely on the list. For my picks today, I'm starting things off with this Technofiber TF40 305 18 by 20. Um, in the last few years, I've been using more open string patterns, typically 16, 19, but I'm really digging this 18, 20 lately. Um, I hit with it a lot when I was at Indian Wells and the courts are a little faster um, outdoors, or at least in the desert, the ball flies a little faster. So I really like the control, the feel of the 1820 string bed. And as far as this frame goes, super solid with the foam inside. Uh, just comfortable, solid filling frame. So I really love this one lately. Um, the next item up, I have a Kirschbaum string here, the Proline Evolution, and it's a great bang for your buck. I think this poly is uh, just really, really predictable. Good control, good feel for a poly. Um, Kirschbaum pre-stretches their strings so they maintain well over time. And it's also pretty comfortable, great deal. Right now, I think we have it for about $6. I think the regular price is about $7.50, so you really can't beat um, this Copoly string. And then the last item for today is just my RF hat. We sell them on the website. Um, comfortable feel, comfortable fit to the hat. Uh, really like wearing these hats. And if you're a Roger fan or just a fan of tennis, um, good one to get. 
Hey guys, this week I have two products that I have been gushing about. You know when you're like kind of in that honeymoon phase and you have butterflies, you're so excited about loving something new. That's where I'm at right now with the new Prince Tour 98. This racket has been so much fun for me to play test. I cannot put it down. It's just got that perfect blend of controllable power and for someone like me who likes to dictate but also has to be careful not to make mistakes early in the point, this racket feels so comfortable. It's got a little bit of a thicker beam at the tip but a thinner beam around the throat so it still has that very low RA at around 62 but I'm still able to generate a ton of power when I want to step up and put balls away. Easy depth. I'm, I, I can't say enough good things. I can't wait for you guys to see the full play test and see how great this option is. Um, the Prince Tour 98 definitely keep your eyes out. It's coming soon. Not available yet but very soon. Get excited. And then for footwear, I'm also very excited about the new Adidas Ava Court shoes. These are amazing. I've worn them already about 10 to 15 hours and I can't take them off my feet. They not only look great, but they're super comfortable. And I know a lot of ladies out there have been wearing the Stella Courts from Adidas and we love those shoes as well, but they're getting hard to find. And I would say this fits just as well as that shoe. Plus the underfoot comfort is super comfortable, very plush and cushioned. And these are just a little bit lighter, more modern, streamlined. They look great on and off the court. So I can't say enough about these new Ava Court shoes. Be sure to check the website for a couple different color options. They're awesome. And I know ladies out there are very excited about this new offering from Adidas. So take a closer look at a bunch of these items. Be sure to go check out our website. And every week we do have playtester picks on our website under the vlog. So go check that out as well at tenniswarehouse.com.